Hey everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create, and we're working on page seven. Okay, page seven, we're gonna have a pocket that is five by four and a half, five by four and a half. You're gonna score a half inch on three of the four sides. It's gonna get installed on the right hand edge of the page. Okay, got a little bit of tape residue. So I'll just take that off. I love this thing. It's horrible to look at, but it works really well. Okay, we have two flaps here. We have one flap that is six by eight, score half inch. And that's gonna go right here. It's gonna go flush with the left-hand edge of the paper, uh, the pocket page. <clears throat> okay, now this one is five and a half by eight. Five and a half by eight. We have our tape on. I'm going to remove my backing. Okay, now I'm going to rest, rest it on the flap that's uh, going to be beneath it. And then I'm just gonna close it gently and let it find its location. There we go. <clears throat> I actually want it to go that way. So that's pretty much the interactive elements for this page. And then we are gonna have an insert the insert is going to be three and three quarters by seven. Three and three quarters by seven. Okay. And that's going to go right inside this pocket. And that's like so. Okay, I'll be back in just a few minutes once I line up my papers. Oops, I forgot. We need to put a magnet here. <clears throat> So we're gonna hold this closed with a magnet. Okay, here we go. Now we're done with the interactive elements. I'll be back in a few minutes with all the papers. Hey everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create, and we are working on page seven of Let It Snow, Graphic 45's latest collection. And I have to think about this for a second. Uh, this is from the 8x8 collection. And it's going to be our main flap. And I've already inked it, that's good. My goodness, I'm gonna do that again. And I think I'm gonna use a contrast sheet so I can better see my edges. There we go. Just making sure I've got this right side up. 
That's the way it goes. So for the pocket, I've got two pieces. I'm gonna color block this. This will go right here. Uh, that's not it. Mm, let it snow, here we go. This is just a border strip out of the 12 by 12 collection pack. This is going to go right below it. I think I need, nope, it looks like it's ready to go. I thought I might need to trim it, but it's ready. This is from the 8x8 collection. Okay, now I've got two. Um, border strips and I'm going to put between these two and then also over here. Okay, and these are half inch. And this is from the patterns and solids. And then I'm going to use the snowflake to back the pocket. And it's going to fit. I'm going to leave my leading edge without glue so I can slide it into the pocket and back it out if I need to to get it uh, placed right. You know what? I'm going to I'm going to take a little bit off. So I have a black border. I think I'm gonna like this a little bit better. Still need a little bit more. That's right. Okay, we'll add some more glue and re ink well. I think the sides adds more glue. I need a few minutes to organize and we will start on the inside. Well, actually, before I do that, let's go ahead and work on our insert. So I've got an insert designed. I'm 
using my corner chopper. <clears throat> this strip is one inch. Okay, and this is um, a strip from the 12 by 12. It just says, let it snow. I'm gonna place that right here. And then we're gonna trim this to fit. nice little insert ready okay so the next thing is we need to work on the inside features so I'll be back in a few minutes after I get a little bit more organized and we'll lay down the interior colors alrighty I'm back here we go can't remember if I recorded this but I used the um, patterns and solids for the A side of the flap. I think I may have already done that with you guys online. I chose uh, the snowflakes for the left and right, and then we're gonna use this um, eight by eight sheet right here in the middle. So patterns and solids, and then eight by eight. pretty. I like it. I like it. I don't normally think of red and snowflakes, but I think it's pretty. Page seven, build seven. Okay, I'll be back shortly with page eight. 